Uh, hey guys, uh, today I will be showing you how to create users, create roles, and assigning uh, these roles uh, to your users. So let's get started. So first, we'll create a new user. Just go to users, create new user. So first, let's go to the first name. So what is that? This is Joe. Last name. Let's make it hands. So that's Joe. Gmail.com. So this is uh, ACL. We can find it here. So ACL means that it is somewhat kind of a specific role. So for instance, if you want to assign this user as an admin, you can click admin or reseller or just a user. So these three are just the default one. But if you want to create another role, so just go to create new ACL this one so first let's go back so let's assign this to five we'll assign this one to uh, user first so make Joe so let's get the password so uh, this is a uh, security level, meaning if you will set, uh, set this high uh, and you are you have actually um, a dynamic um, IP address accessing to cyber panel, uh, it is noted that you will not able to log in if your um, IP changes so this is good for um, static set uh, static IP address and if you will set this low will uh, good uh, for those who have then an IP address so let's create user first okay so now we'll create an ACL so for instance this is a moderator so just click here which um, roles you want to assign to a moderator uh, for instance I'll just click here to create website modify website so this is this is the, the uh, default one so if you want to make this admin just click admin but we have already add an admin by default so just create an acl okay let, let's refresh now you have here the moderator so that's it so let's try to create another user for instance let's add names so this is just for tutorial purposes so let's make this user as a reseller so we have five here so for instance so once again if you if your user has a dynamic id you use low so if your user have um, a static IP, choose high. So be sure to uh, let your user know about this. Just create user. So let's try to log in one of those users we have just created. So let's log in. So that will be this is just a typical user. 
so this is the dashboard of uh, user so let's view profile here it is so it, this user has limited um, access to cyber panel so that's yeah, that's it let's go to our reseller user okay let's log in okay this one this is the reseller um, user so he he or she can um, add um, create users to use a part of um, his or her uh, reseller server so um, let's create a user for the reseller okay let's create a new user so like this let's use name Joe uh, those email of course there is one user so next um, we'll add just one so if you want to increase this for this user just go to resource center uh, username let's put it here Just create user. Next, if you want to increase this, first let's go to list users. This username has only one website. If you want to increase this, let's go to reseller sensor. Select the user and uh, new owner. So let's make this uh, to just save changes so now uh, let's go to list users now it has to so this is how you will add users uh, in cyber panel and assign roles as well and creating roles uh, modifying roles modifying users uh, and this ends our um, tutorial this day. So I hope you have learned something or learned something new in this video. So I hope you like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon.